Cooper's Hawk, what's this called? Passion fruit, this is so good, so, so, so good. But we're gonna go out. It's my friend's birthday, but deep down I'm celebrating my graduation as well. <laughs> we just gonna bunch it at someone, but I'm gonna be there for the first birthday, but I'm deep down I'm gonna be celebrating myself. Glasses. So my mama bought me these glasses yesterday from Cooper's Hawk, and these are so cute. Look at the gold detail. Like, these glasses are so cute. Yeah, and they glass too. Well, of course they should be glass, right? These, these are like $15 per glass. And I'm like, I just, yeah. But they can Cooper's Hearts too, and I really love the design on them. They really, really cute. But anyways, so we gonna try this. Uh, well, I already know what it tastes like. Well, you know what it tastes like too. Okay, Chris, I already know what it tastes like. But we're gonna try it again. Oh man, oh, I got my fancy bottle opener that my friend brought me. Yes, okay, she comes through. Y'all need one of these, an electric wine opener. I forgot Cooper's Hawk, they stuff be corked. I think all of them is corked, right? Yeah. Yeah, every single one. So, my friend gifted me this, ooh. Luckily it's already on it. Yeah. I think I put batteries in. I think this battery operated. Oh, am I doing it right? Oh, yeah, there you go. Wait, is it going down? Or am I... Wait. Don't work if you man. Never ever boom. Just like that. You pour it like real fancy. So good. They pour it out kind of slow, but that's fine. The so birthdays and graduations, okay? Y'all. So, anyways, y'all already know. Yesterday was a very great day, okay? Um, let me, t let me, let me, let me tell y'all something. Let me tell y'all something. Don't ever let anybody try to tell you there's a time limit on when you do anything. Those people are the ones that rush into things and then shit don't work out. Cause they too busy trying to meet this, meet these unrealistic expectations in life. You know, and I'm not saying, I'm not saying you shouldn't have a deadline for it, but let it be something that's realistic. You know what I'm saying? Like, let your goals be realistic. People try to keep up with the internet or keep up with how other people's views of life are supposed to go. Like, no, mm -mm. be your own person. Roll the way you want to roll, and I'm telling you, you'll get a lot further. Because I'm telling you, when I stop caring about how, uh, what other, what time things are supposed to be done, like how fast they're supposed to be done. When I start letting things flow and I just really start homing in on what was best for me, things start turning out. I'll tell you that, things start turning out the way I wanted them to. Now everybody be all up in my business. Y'all know who y'all is. Y'all be all up in my business trying to figure out how my life is going somewhere else because I'm worried about my race and nobody else's. I'm focused on my path and nobody else's. I'm not sitting up here comparing myself to the next person. Oh, well this person has gotten ahead and this is what they're doing. Dang, what can I do to try to catch up with them? Y'all need to stop trying to play catch up with the Joneses and start focusing on yourself. And don't let these internet people fool you neither. They be going through a lot. They just don't be telling y'all about it. 
and I don't know. I'm a, I don't know if I'm the type of person that shares my my downfalls. I don't know. That's not me. I like to I like, I like to take my L's in private. <laughs> right. I like to say for real, cause you know the internet. They be, I feel like they be wanting too much from you. They be wanting too much of your. They want to see you fail. People want to see you. It's okay to for people to give you a little bit when they going through something just a little bit but people can't give you too much honey people cannot give you too much you know there's a lot of people that be out here ruining on people's downfalls they want you to be sad they want you to be down and out just like them because misery loves company and people love getting on the internet and just seeing you not at your best now we all know the internet is very much curated people only show the good parts of their life we already know this but look that's just the way the world works you think if i'm going through something that I'm gonna sit there and say, well y'all I'm doing this, this, this. I'm not gonna tell y'all that for what why would I want y'all some of the knowing something that's that's cutting me deep or I'm really taking the L on why would I want y'all to know that now it, it depends on what the situation is if I feel like it's a learning experience that you know it's it's something it's an L but it's not a major L you know if it's more of a learning experience I'll definitely share that but I ain't finna be out here Telling my relationship and all the girl, girl no. Yeah, I'm gonna pull me up some more of this. I'm gonna girl, I'm gonna be a little bit lit. And I gotta be I gotta be on time for work tomorrow because I'm working with my boss. <laughs> I can't be late. <laughs> I gotta be on time tomorrow. I gotta be on time tomorrow. Like I'm working with my boss, so I have to be I I don't have a choice, like I have to be on time. I right, well, you better set that alarm ten times. Hold on, let me see what time I told him. Cause last time I was late. He like, what time are you supposed to be here? He go, my ass, 10.30. <laughs> and it was like 10.45. I'm supposed to be there at 10. I told myself I was going to be there at 10 o'clock. Look, I ain't had no reason to be late, y'all. I legit, I didn't have no reason to be late. But, you know, I mean, I'm going to let the universe guide me. If I can't make it, I can't make it on time. I'm just going to get there when I get there. Mm -hmm. Was that girl? We cannot have the same I notification. Know, know, Cause I'm like looking. Yeah, so we finna get up out of here. We like we can, we kind of rush it. But yeah, I wanted to show y'all this really cute purse that I got from Zara. It comes with like two straps. It was like thirty five dollars pre tax, you guys pre tax. And let me show y'all real quick. Like here's some like some of the detailing. So cute. It has a little. Um, things at the bottom so your purse doesn't touch the counters or wherever you sit it down at. Then you do have the short handles. Like basically you have three handle choices. And it's like the cutest thing. So, and y'all see I got my makeup on. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm gonna switch out the straps actually. Cause when I wore this for my graduation, I just had all the straps on there. I was like, girl, why did you take any of these straps off? So yeah, this is like what Chris said. You said some more chillax strap. Mm -hmm. It's some more. It make, yeah, make it a little bit more street like attire. Street, yeah, street wear. Sporting. Yeah. So I'm gonna put that on. Cause we finna roll. And then it's gotta. We gotta get up out of here. Damn, I don't know where my house keys at, but my door finna be open. Don't worry, y'all. I live in a good apartment building. So. <laughs> so y'all gonna pack this is a mini fan boom i gotta pack this chanel hand lotion chanel -y. okay um this is not getting packed that's my friends and then this is my wallet i'm just gonna take whatever i need out of here so Got my ID and the cards that I'm gonna possibly use. My money be spread out, honey, in all accounts. Yeah. So I got like three cards. This ain't got no. Oh wow, this ain't got no pockets. Okay, pack that. And then let me grab my lip and my powder. Yeah, this is my cute ass puffer. It's from Zara. So cute. Yes, like they only have one of these. This is an extra small. Really? Yep. This is an extra. You will fit this. You That's probably it'll probably still be a little bit big on you, but yeah. yeah this is my my puffy y'all from Zara. Puffer. Okay. 
It's puffer season in Chicago. Oh, <laughs> Extra battery. Oh, I'm going to some gym shoes. Make sure Bella ass is locked the fuck up. Cause ain't nobody got time to come home and hang this out the cage. Need this brown thing for this. Let me just get a little bit more, Chris. I promise. Let me just get a little bit more. Now this is how nice for me go. That's why I never vlog because everything is like you just start rushing. Everything just be like a rush. Okay. She moved out of state and shit that went left. She's seeking forgiveness. She used to dance, but she went alone and start up a business. The daddy is not around. Her mama is not around. I watch her climb on the top of the pole and then get sliding down. I make it rain in this bitch. I make it snow in this bitch. She trying to get out of the mix. Shawty is going to jail. Shawty is going to jail. Me, I'm supporting this shit. This is a story to take my life and I'm just recording this shit. I'ma just give it to you direct instead of me going and shit. You know you important and shit. You know I'm supporting this shit. We used to do bonos when you would come over, but now you got morals and shit. I got like four on the wrist and an adorable kid. I got a Drake in the studio, and I don't just mean that I'm in this bitch. Please make the most of this shit. Don't just come close to some shit. I give you this bread, you run me some head, and then you go blow up a beat. She moved out of state. What? What? Stop. Like over ten thousand oh, oh, Uh huh. It's not as easy as it looks, is it? Gonna be celebrating Christmas tomorrow. Like you couldn't have told me that this year would have flew like this. I'd have been like, you lying, sis. But the year really did fly. I know a lot of people say that all the time, but I don't know. I just feel like, you know, once you get past, you know, high school, like it's just the years just take off. Anyways, today I'm just gonna be wrapping hella gifts. Um, what me and my family like to do, we like to do Secret Santa or grab bag whatever you guys like to call it but of course around the holidays it's more like secret santa you know what i'm saying so we did that and i have some things for my cousin that i am going to be wrapping up for her oh let me show y'all i bought the cutest wrapping paper from amazon i want an aesthetically pleasing wrapping experience like when i look under my tree they look bomb, you know what I'm saying? The color scheme is basically white, pink, rose gold, and gray. These four rolls came together as a packet and they were $20 and each roll is 125 square feet. So I feel like I should have enough wrapping paper to do what I need to do. Uh, I also bought these bows and then I bought some ribbon. You guys see the vision? You see the vision. Okay, you guys, so this is currently what's going on under my tree. I have quite a few things that I need to wrap. I actually started putting some things in boxes last night. So I have three boxes. I have some things in here that need to get wrapped. Those are gonna get wrapped. This is gonna get wrapped. Anything you see here is up to be wrapped, essentially. I really want, you know, an aesthetically pleasing, you know, moments under my tree. 
this is a better look at the wrapping paper so cute then you have this one really cute okay this with the deers isn't that just so bomb wow and then of course some classic rose gold paper closer look at the what's these called the ribbons and the bows wrapping and yeah I really love it like everything is just coming together so amazing this year wow hopefully you guys really love the wrapping paper as much as I know that um, you know the holidays is basically over with as far as Christmas you can definitely pick up that rose gold paper. Like say you have someone that you would really like to, you know, wrap a gift with. That rose gold paper, that's any time, any season. That's beautiful. Like, let me give you guys like a view like outward. I feel like my couch needs to be fixed. <laughs> oh, let me fix my couch. My couch needs to be fixed. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, so yeah, that's how it looks like just giving you guys a like nice little view i ran out of material to do bows so i switched to this tinsel so um i have like white tinsel and stuff like that i didn't have any like rose gold kind of tinsel so i was like you know what we're just gonna do the bows and then the ones that's able to get rose gold bows you know what i'm saying okay whatever but <laughs> i don't know i feel like i'm doing too much for you know i don't know whatever i'm not doing enough okay i'm not doing enough this just ties in so well the rose gold in the center it just ties in so well with my tree topper <laughs> all right so I'm, I'm dressed ready to go or whatever so i got my gloss i literally just threw on some face powder and that's it i had to drop off this visa gift card what's a mastercard gift card to the last door person we have four door people and i decided to gift them 20 25 dollar MasterCard gift cards. Alright, got the car keys, got my backpack, and got this box. Stick it to the shoes. And yeah. Where oh where's my phone? Um, I'm not 
sexy really. No, I don't know what she is. Okay, and we are out of here. Off in the van, got me to stop playing, y'all. Got the stop playing. We got the. It's already mixed in too. It's, I hope this ain't turkey. Do it taste like turkey? I have. I'll say because you know turkey be real blend. I don't like turkey meat. Taste it. I'll say it's it ain't turkey. It is turkey, but it don't taste like. Something told in my soul. I don't like turkey. I know. Especially no nachos. I swear we got beef eaters up in here. This tastes like turkey. I ain't had no. You don't gotta have it. You don't like turkey meat? Not in uh, nachos. Not lie, but... It's still good though. I tasted it already. So I'm just gonna try to sprinkle out as much cheese as possible. It's a lot of meat. Damn bougie. It's a lot of meat. What you talking about? If, I, if, I was if you would've came earlier, she ain't have meat in it. And you could've got you some without Y'all, earlier, you came yeah. late. It's 9.15. No, it ain't. You <laughs> <laughs> I'm always like, not an This is hot. It's hot all through this house. No, I'm talking about though. I burned my mouth. What I'm with you. Thanks. You hurt yourself? Come here. Eat this ice. I'm not good. Eat some of the dog, y'all. Dog, eat ice. Don't die. I didn't need you for it.